Wow. I'll tell you what, Gail, but that got me a little bit right in the hearts. The history of Impact Wrestling, the thousand episodes, and of course, the knockout division. Without the beautiful people, the greatest entrance in pro wrestling, Tom. Love a six time knockouts world champion, Velvet Sky, a two time knockouts world champion, one of the most influential women's tandems in the history of professional wrestling. And of course, they thought. Never exactly played well with others. The legends that they are, I'm <laughs> sure uh, they've got a thing or two to say here on the 1,000th episode of Impact Wrestling. I'm told some thrones were brought in for backstage. I'm Absolutely. told Q Kip unfortunately couldn't make it. Uh, there are some makeovers being doled out, and there might be some paper bags issue. Oh. I think you deserve one. Oh, what, are you kidding me? Look in the mirror, Hannibal, or better yet, just look at the monitor. <laughs> You'll be much happier. Angelina Love and Velvet Sky are back in Impact Wrestling. Angelina Love will be in competition next week as a part of the Colossal 10 Knockouts Tag Team matchup. That's going to be a huge sum of the best of the past, present, and future all in one ring. to see you as always. And great video package of the knockouts that you showed. But I got a question for you. Are you sure that's the best of the knockouts division that you could show? Because obviously the clips of myself, Angelina Love, and my bestie, Velvet Sky, the beautiful people were absolutely perfect. But the rest of the video, all I saw was a bunch of ugly people. Kind of like the ugly that's standing in front of me right now. That's you. That's you, Gail. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I mean, there were some good clips, of course the clips of the beautiful people. All the other clips looked like security cam footage from Walmart. Or the before and after pictures at a dermatologist's office with just the befores. Well, it's really nice to see you both too. Welcome back. You're welcome. And I know the fans are so excited to see you back. The nostalgia, the feelings, the excitement, seeing the beautiful people do what they do best, being rude and obnoxious. <sighs> Look, Angelina, it's one of the befores. <laughs> even though we wish you wouldn't. I can do more than just talk if you like. <laughs> oh, this is about to break down here. Maybe the quintessential diva can bring some calm back to the proceedings. Let me be real honest. I really doubt that's the possibility. Oh, well, you're one of the befores, Hannah. You wouldn't understand. Ladies, ladies. Ladies, I am so sorry that Gail is being quite rude to you. But you know what, allow me. Thank you. 
allow me to apologize on behalf of the current Knockouts division and say, welcome back, beautiful people. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. Seriously, though, I can honestly say that without the beautiful people, there would be no quintessential diva. You paved the way for knockouts like me. And I am truly honored to have taken your spot and improved on it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you say improved? Uh, yes, improved. I am P R O V E D, improved, having become or been made better. Improved. Tell me this, sister, who exactly is so great from your generation? One example, the juggernaut, Jordan Grace, who returned this past weekend at Victory Road, defeating the three-time Knockouts World Champion, Deanna Perrazzo. No argument there, exploding back onto the impact scene. Well, Velvet, I'm from Giselle's generation, or rather, Giselle is from my generation. And there are two constants in every generation. The first are the greats, ODB. Tara. Tracy Brooks. and the amazing Gail Kim. Unfortunately for everyone, the other constant is the annoying, vapid bitches. in women's wrestling and impact wrestling look no further than the virtuosa. Deanna Perrazzo is in no doubt a foul mood following Victory Road. Deanna Perrazzo second only to Gail Kim. Total days as Knockouts World Champion in the history of this company. That is the definition of a constant. It is why the age of the virtuosa is always about. What a coincidence, right? I'm assuming you're here to help represent the annoying bitches. Actually, Jordan, I'm here to represent my generation. Not yours, and certainly not Giselle's. You see, we've been in the age of the virtuosa since I stepped foot here in Impact Wrestling. And if my memory serves me correctly, it started when I beat you for the Knockouts World Championship. <laughs> well, if you're gonna speak about the Knockouts World Championship, you better speak about the current champion, 
Trinity! Trinity! One of the only people who can say she's made the virtuosa herself tap out not once but twice and was victorious again as well at Victory Road against Alicia Edwards. The era of Trinity is off to an auspicious start here in Impact Wrestling. Trinity is not only undefeated in singles competition here in Impact since arriving on the scene, but she has taken the division to new heights, has opened up eyes all around the world to what Impact Wrestling, the knockouts division, what this company has to offer. And that's what makes Impact Wrestling and the knockouts division so good, always pushing limits. You know, I respect each and every one of you in this ring. Because you've all paved the way for me in your own ways. But respectfully, I am the knockout who's currently blazing a trail for the future because I am in my moment and the proof is right here around my waist. The Knockout World Title! <laughs> I'm so glad that you're proud of your one measly title reign. Come find me when you've had three, okay? And Deanna, you can come find me when you've had seven. Generation now, generation forever talk. All this generation talk don't mean a thing without generation flavor. Oh, <laughs> we 
which is why your girl will be the fifth member of Team Beautiful People. Giselle Shaw and Savannah Evans, and of course, my girl, Deanna Perrazzo. Now, summing all this up here tonight, it seems like every one of you want to be the best knockout, right? You all want to be the best. But one thing you can't be is the greatest that beat the greatest. <laughs> and since I am the greatest that beat the greatest, how about next week in this knockouts tag, I be the greatest that beat the biggest. is about to explode with the level of talent in this arena. And yes, once upon a time, Steele's won her lone knockouts world title for Mickey James, but Mickey is a five-time knockouts world champion. come out here and remind you of who I am or what I've done or look at me Tasha or try to convince somebody that I am the greatest because straight out of the horse's mouth would you say would you say I am the greatest that's right thanks Shooks. is Hardcore Country is back. And if you hadn't noticed, this is your public service announcement, okay? That I am officially the fifth member of Champ Trinity, Gail Kim, Jordan Grace, and the awesomest of Kong in a team I like to call Team Over. While tonight is a night of celebration of 1,000 episodes of Impact Wrestling and a celebration of the history that this Knockouts division right here has laid out before you, make no mistake about it, next week is going to be a fight. And you can guarantee, ladies, it's going to be the greatest fight in knockouts history. Call it an evolution, a revolution. We don't give a damn. It started here. This is women's wrestling. The 